hi guys welcome back to my channel so in today's video as you can tell by the title i have another home decor haul for you guys you guys love those and i love bringing them to you so thank you so 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 much for supporting my channel if you are new to my family you can hit that red subscribe button and also the little bell next to it so that you never miss an upload and if you are a returning subscriber welcome back so i have been to z gallery bed bath and beyond tj maxx uh ross and home goods and I believe that's it so if you're interested in seeing the goodies that I got keep on watching so um, I am going to start with Bath and Body Works as you guys know they are having their semi-annual sale well it's almost over now everything's already picked over I went last weekend so that was um, week two of the sale so they didn't have a ton of stuff but I didn't need a ton of stuff because I still had some candles left over from throughout the year so I did pick up this wallflower and technically I think this is a winter one but I like bling stuff anyway so the snowflakes look like bling to me um and so I got this this was let's see how much it was hmm four dollars and twenty cents at first it was ten fifty so I got it for four dollars and twenty cents and then this is the cotton blossom scent so I have this plugged into the wall up here and it smells really really good um the next candle that i got now some of the packaging was a little weird but these are scents that i normally get this is the rose water and ivy scent i like clean scents i don't like sweet scents or food scents or any of those types of things i don't like the outdoorsy scents i just like the really fresh clean um scent so this one is called rose water and ivy but the packaging has new york on it so i don't really care about the packaging i just care how it smells and it's a very, very clean, subtle scent. I love this one, Rose Water and Ivy. So I got this, and this was, with my coupon, um, it came out to $8.40. So not that bad for a $24.50 candle regular price, which I would never pay. The second candle I got, and this is the last thing that I got, was an old-time favorite. This is my all-time favorite from bath and body works it is called pure white cotton i love it i don't care what the packaging looks like i'm burning it now it smells so 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 good so to get this one again for 840 was a steal and i was so happy <sighs> it smells so 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 good so um to get this one for 840 i was really really happy about that so that's all that i got from bath and body works again i didn't need a ton of stuff because i still had a few candles that i hadn't even burned yet and i just started burning the other pure white cotton that I have so that's it from Bath and Body Works um let's do Z Gallery next now I did order the Z Gallery it's like a glass knot to go in my master bedroom in the cerulean color it finally went on clearance from $35 down to $17 so I thought it would sell out before it went down even lower so I went ahead and got that but that did ship out yesterday and I should get it on Monday but I didn't want to hold up the video for that so you guys um, can actually go on Z Gallery's website and see that because it's still available I got it in the cerulean color which I believe is the only color that's on clearance I got these these are candle holders I told you guys that I was interested in having some built-in shelves built in my formal living room here so I, I'm grabbing things that I see that are on sale that I know would look nice on those shelves so and I'm not going to unwrap both of these because they're wrapped so nicely. I'm just going to unwrap one. But I did get two of these candle holders. And they're so pretty. They're felted on the bottom. These are called, from Z Gallery, the uh, Pillar Holder Verve Silver. The Verve Pillar Holders. I'm not sure if that's how you pronounce it. But they were $29.95 originally. And I got them for um they were marked down from 29.95 to 14.89 and i got them for eight dollars and some change um but they hadn't marked them down again so i did order them online and do store pickup so they were all wrapped up when i got there and i got two of these so i thought this was really really pretty it's silver um they're not too heavy but they do have some weight to them and it's felted on the bottom so they won't mess up your furniture surface so i thought these were a good deal for eight dollars in um home goods or tj maxx or marshall's they probably would be a little bit more than that maybe like twelve dollars so i thought eight dollars was a good buy and you can actually fit a pillar candle holder or a pillar candle in them so i thought that was really really pretty so i got two of these from z gallery moving right along i was in let's see 
Where was I at? I was in TJ Maxx not too long ago, and I needed some measuring spoons. So I thought these were nice because this was a 12-piece set, and it's by the Farberware brand. It was $3.99, so not bad at all. And, of course, it has all the measurements on it. I was in dire need of these, so I grabbed those. I also grabbed this just because it was interesting to me. It is a bottle cap remover. It's supposed to be automatic. It says magically open beer bottles. I don't drink beer, but just in case I host something, um, I thought this was really cute. So it just says after placing on bottle, one push on the opener magically removes the cap. So I thought that was pretty cool. We shall see. Um, I was in dire need of a toilet brush for obvious reasons so I thought this one was really dainty and pretty so I grabbed this one um, it was $9.99 at TJ Maxx and then you know these it's black inside which is fine but these do have the um, can that you can take out and clean as well so that was important for me so I grabbed this moving right along I was in home goods. I actually got this stuff today and I am, if you haven't been following me on social media or you haven't watched any of my vlogs, I put in a um, closet made system in my master bedroom closet. So I'm in the process of redoing that. And I decided to switch to all velvet hangers because I've heard great things about them and I've heard that they are great safe space savers. So I grabbed some of these and I grabbed quite a few of these. This is a 35 pack of the black non-slip velvet hangers for $16.99 and I did get these from Home Goods. Um, I got three packs of these and last night I got five packs of the Farberware brand. They're the exact same hangers, they're just a different brand. There were 25 in a pack for $9.99. I got five packs and I used all 125 hangers already so I needed some more. So I got three packs of 35. They didn't have the same brand but they look identical so I grabbed these. While I was in Home Goods, I came across these candles and I thought they were really, really pretty. I think they're meant for weddings, but that's not a rule. These are, they say Mr. and Mrs. F and W, but the bottom of them are silver and the top is white. So I do a lot of silvers and grays and whites um, in my house. So I thought these were pretty and these would go with a lot of things and they were $7.99. And these are actually the size that will fit in the Z Gallery candle holders as well. They're taped together, but they'll fit in there as well. Not that I would use one of these in there, but these would be really nice on my candle holders on my coffee table. So I grabbed them. They do smell very, very good as well, but I won't be burning them. They're just for decor purposes, but they're really, really pretty. So I grabbed these. And last weekend, while I was with the client, I um, went into Ross and I found this figurine. I thought this would be pretty to put on the built-in bookshelves as well. I've been looking for one of these. It is a camera um, porcelain figurine for YouTube. You know, I do YouTube, so why not? I thought this was really cute. And I've seen them in gold, I believe, but I've never seen them in silver. So when I found this, I was so excited. And I think this would be so cute on top of some um, decorative books or something like that. Um, or even on a shelf by itself with maybe some greenery with it. It just looks really, really um, nice to me. And it was set $6.99. And yeah, so this represents me being a YouTuber and a creator. So I thought this was cute. So I grabbed that from Ross. And my all-time favorite purchases were these kitchen items from Ross. They were so, so, so adorable. Actually, my client find them, my client and my friend, she's my friend as well, um, found them first and they caught her eye first and she pointed them out to me and I had to have them. They did come in a mint color as well, but I wasn't interested in that one, uh, in those colors. So these are it. They're kitchen utensils, but they are pink and rose gold. They are so pretty. They're by the Kitchen Collective brand. And this is the whisk. It was $3.99 at Ross and it is so so pretty i needed a whisk as well but i'm not even convinced that i'm going to use the like they're so pretty so um, i'm definitely excited about them i got those and i was recently in i believe it was 
TJ Maxx last night, another TJ Maxx, and they had so many different colors. Um, they didn't have the pink, but they had the mint, they had um, black, they had gray, mixed with the rose gold. So if you're in the hunt for them, you can look in Home Goods, Ross, or TJ Maxx. They also had the tongs as well, but they didn't have pink last night. I got this set as well, and this has five different spoons, a ladle, a spatula, and I think this is like a strainer spoon. And this was $7.99. And these are all connected by like the ring that you can take off. Um, I don't know that you can. Oh yeah, you can reclose it as well. So these, this keeps them all together. So I thought this was cute as well. So I got that. Also, I picked up some measuring um, spoons. Now I had already bought these, but of course these are so much better. So these were $3.99 and these were $4.99, but I think they were worth the extra dollar because it's rose gold and pink. So pretty, so I grabbed those. And then the last item that they had at Ross that I got was a spatula, but it was a different type of spatula that then was included in um, the set there. And this was $3.99 as well from the same brand, Kitchen Collective. So I thought these were really, really, really pretty. And so now I'm going to take you around my house and show you some large ticket items that I brought that are too big to fit in the frame. Okay, so here is my new um, bed for my dog, Lady. It's really, really pretty. It has the acrylic legs and it is a tufted like sofa bench. And I think she's really going to like it. She hasn't used it yet because I just got it. Um, but I'm going to try to introduce her to it uh, a little later on today. And let me get a little closer so you can see the brand and the price. So this is the brand here. Tanoki. It's a pet lounge with acrylic legs, as you can see from the picture. And the price is on, underneath it. It was $69.99 at TJ Maxx. Okay guys, and so here are the mirror, or here is the mirror that I purchased. I purchased two of these to go in my uh, basement family room. Excuse the noise, I'm doing some laundry. But they were $39.99 each, but I'm just gonna show you one here. And here it is. These are what you call, I think, window pane mirrors, and I just really, really love them. They have them in gray as well, but I decided to get the white just because my walls are already painted gray. Okay guys, so this is another large purchase that I made. I purchased two of these nightstands. I purchased them on Overstock. Um, they were on sale at the time that I ordered them. I also had a 12 or 15% off coupon, so I ended up paying $204 for each one. But I love them, so now I just need a mirror to go over them and some um, nice lamps. And I think they will be very, very beautiful. So hopefully you like them too. Again, right now this color is sold out again on Overstock. I waited for months for them to be back in stock and they were only in stock for a few days. They are available in gold as well. But I know other retailers have similar um, nightstands as well. So again, I paid $204 for each one. Okay guys, so this is another large purchase that I made. I purchased this bench from Ross. It was uh, $69.99. It does have the acrylic legs and then on each of the corners it has nail head trim, but just on the corners. And it actually, I don't know what the material of this is. I don't know if it's microfiber or suede or something, but it matches the material of my bedding. So I thought it was a perfect match and I brought it home. I love it. I still need to get a bed skirt, so just ignore that. But I love this bench and I didn't need a super long bench because I only have a queen bed and my room is not the largest. So I thought this would be perfect. I'm going to center it and maybe put an accent pillow on it once I make up my bed and stuff like that and put the room together. But I love this and this came from Ross again for $70. Okay guys, so that's it for this video. It wasn't a ton of stuff, but I just wanted to bring it to you before um, I start putting it away and putting it in the rooms that they will eventually be housed in. I hope you really enjoyed this video and I will see you next time in the next video. So until then, take care, bye. And Lady says bye too, she's right here. Here you go. Say bye Lady. Bye guys.